Hello everybody, Dane here and welcome to my May 2021 booktuber shout outs. Dane reads. So as always, I have 10 channels. I have a little list here prepared that I'm just gonna try and get up on my phone, uh, assuming my internet allows me to. And uh, we're gonna go through and chat 10 of these channels. Now these will all be linked below as well. So the first channel is The Bookish Report, Alex. He specializes in doing like gas lamp um, horror, I guess. So a lot of things like Poe, uh, I guess Henry James, Turn of the Screw, all kinds of that, all of that kind of, uh, all of that like good Victorian stuff, but also some more recent stuff like he normally cites, I think Laura Purcell's The Silent Companions. Companions. Really nice guy, he's from Manchester. So uh, big up for being from the north of England. I'm from the Midlands, so he's from further north, further north than I am. Great guy, great chap, uh, writer as well. I haven't had the, uh, uh, pop, I haven't had the pleasure yet of reading any of his work, but I look forward to it. All right, up next we have Al from Big Hard Books and Classics. As the name suggests, he reads Big Hard Books and Classics, but honestly, the dude reads a bit of everything. He's also a musician. Um, I know him primarily as like playing, a, playing um, a harmonica, mouth harp, whatever you want to call it. But he also plays a little bit of guitar, and he's not too bad at it if, uh, if I say so myself. And uh, yeah, definitely check out Al. He's a great guy, great channel. And Al, if you're watching, hopefully you're still doing well with your quitting smoking, buddy. Okay, then we have Joel Swagman. Uh, Joel mostly does reviews, I would say. He's actually kept a book blog for many years now, and um, so a lot of his videos are what he calls scripted reviews. So basically, he goes into his uh, book blog and takes the reviews from that and turns them into video reviews, which I think is a really cool approach of doing it. Uh, yeah, definitely just one of those channels you should watch. I think he also teaches English as a foreign language, but that might just be me going mad. Then we have Marie McWilliams, she's mostly a horror tuber, although again she does do a little bit of everything. Her tags are a lot of fun, uh, she's a really nice lady and uh, has a great accent as well. That's actually one of the reasons why I watch her videos is because she, I like her accent and her face, she's quite pretty. Um, should I be saying that? Probably not, but hey ho, go watch her channel. Then we have Spinelli Speaks and um, she's one of those booktubers who, I don't know when I came across her actually, and we don't necessarily have a huge like crossover in terms of the books that we read, so I don't watch as many videos of, of, by her as I should do, but every time I do, I'm just really impressed by just how, you know, how thoughtful she is in all of her videos. Um, you can tell that like she puts a lot of time and effort into thinking about what she's gonna say, and it really does come across. And again, just very approachable, very friendly, and a really, you know, important member of the community as well. All right, then we have uh, PG, I ain't finna read that, and uh, I guess PG is short for Pythalo Grey, right? Uh, he's an Albert Camus fan, although he didn't like the plague and I did. We were talking about maybe doing like a collab video on it where we like hop on a call, but I just have so much work on at the moment. I don't really, like, I'm already up to my eyeballs speaking to different people each week from my radio show, and, and I hate doing Zoom calls. But anyway, go out and check his channel. I also like he does a lot of uh, filming on location as well, which, um, you know, I like to get out and see a bit of the world through his videos. Then we have Emma Rosen Books. Emma is uh, an author tuber as well as a book tuber. She's recently done her cover reveal for Milk and Cookies, which is her upcoming book. It's like a children's book to teach kids about breastfeeding, you know, the hows and the whys and the wherefores and all of that stuff. Uh, and there, as far as I know, there isn't really anything on the market like, like that, you know? Uh, she also wrote a book called Milk, which was her memoir of breastfeeding as like first time and then as a second and I think third time. Um, um, and I just think she's doing really important work with her books. Like my books just entertain people. Emma's books like cause actual tangible social change. So go check out Emma. Then we have the archive, Graham Quigley, and uh, he hasn't posted a new video for about five months now, unfortunately, but uh, he did leave a comment on one of my videos recently because I tagged him and he said when he gets back to filming, he's gonna try and do the tag. So I wanna give him a shout out now so that, uh, you know, go check out his channel, give him a bit of support there, and hopefully that'll encourage him to come back soon as well. Then we have Jim's books reading and stuff. <laughs> I like channel names like this because you know he's called Jim, you know he does books, and you know he does reading and stuff. Uh, Jim's relatively new to me. I think he kind of came across my channel and then I checked out his channel as a result of that. Um, but again, another thoughtful guy and uh, he deserves some love. He doesn't have anywhere near as many views and subscribers as he deserves. 
And finally we have The Nihilist Geek, and this is another booktuber that I know, I think through the local Haunts anthology and as part of like the horror tube community. Uh, all basically around like uh, Regina's, uh, what is it, Regina's Haunted Library. She's done a really great job I think with her local Haunts anthology and all of the work that she's done on her channel. She's really kind of created this community around her of just horror lovers and I think it's fantastic. So uh, yeah, and The Nihilist Geek is one of those. And I can't remember his name, I want to say it was like Nikos, but I might be wrong. So there we have it, those are some shout outs for you for the month of May. As always, don't forget to check out all the channels in the description below, they're all linked so you can go through and give them a subscribe. Hit that like button on this video if you've enjoyed it, hit that subscribe button to my channel if you want to see more. Uh, let me know in the comments some of the booktubers you're enjoying at the moment and I'll see you soon for another bookish video. Thanks a lot, bye bye.